please give a huge round of applause to my lovely assistant, Noah. So, if you caught it on Instagram, I haven't done this at least 10 years since I've done this style of poem. Um, so, in this bag, we have 24 books. And every one of them is bookmarked to page 24. So, we are going to do a found poem from the first line of all 24 books marked to page 24. We're going to do a found poem for our friend who's lost. So, Noah, the first book. This will be, all the books will be on our YouTube page because I ain't got time to list them all now. You'd think having bookmark be easier to read. All right. And amid incense and high spiritual hymns, lays in quadruple light her angel limbs. I did not look at any of these beforehand, either. Arnold had previously called it the most perfect brief poem in the language. Bryant gave up a law practice to pursue a literary career. <laughs> if I can stop one heart breaking, I shall not live in vain. You can't drop Emily. And this is the strange refrain which he sang in a minor key. No matter how long the river, the river shall reach the sea. Miss Thang, but can't. How strange this life is mine and not another, this jigsaw, each irrevocable piece. I forgive you nasal cavity and sinuses, the ear canal and clear walled eyeballs, all the head holes open to the rain of light, the floating of atoms in air, the jack together of molecules of the stupid human world. My river was once unseparated. Much madness is divinest sense to a discerning eye. Much sense the starkest madness, tis the majority. A talent for eclectic theft, which it came to stealing lines of poetry out of everybody's conversation. Besides the obvious lost marbles or stolen purse or misplaced lottery ticket, the theme of loss preoccupied her even in sleep. There are also men in the world. Sometimes we forget and think there are only women. Endless hills and plains of unresisting women. We were, we're walking on the boardwalk, but stop when we see a lifeguard and his girlfriend fighting. <laughs> the woman whose backpack I helped lift to the baggage rack in that suddenly sweet compartment of a train was an art historian from her sales. <laughs> Look at the sky, turn a hellfire in red, loud. Somebody's house is burning down, down, down. The hell is this? I've never seen this book. Time to inspect the garden. One star is for Alaska, one star is for Nebraska, one star is North Dakota, one star is Minnesota. There are lots of other stars, but I forget which ones they are. <laughs> the, 
This is the safety catch, which is always released with an easy flick of the thumb. <laughs> My home is full of targets, and they have been hit. <clears throat> Bree. Yes. Yes. Nose diving into scripture, but finding no words to spare. Yes. We kissed in the way that children find their way to kissing, out of curiosity, not romance. I am free. Wait on that. Cat doesn't know any of this, though, and Cat, who is hostile to most boys, and for good reason, is slowly won over by Patrick, who has great hair, and who is also slowly, and in spite of himself, won over by Cat. And the final book. Intimate kisses, the poetry of sexual pleasure. The worst erotic poetry ever written on mankind. The final book, the final page. Between you and a bowl of oranges, I lied nude, reading the world's illusion through my tears. The Dayton Poetry Slam would like to apologize for... <laughs>